Don't look at my sheet. All right, we, <laughs> okay. we've talked about Jeopardy. We've talked about Trustful. We've talked about football. <clears throat> Let's do our own little Trustful Jeopardy here. Okay. I'm going to try and stump you. Don't look at it. Okay, I won't look. Sheet, I won't so look. Don't be cheating. All right, so obviously this isn't real Jeopardy because <laughs> it's just you. So this is more like just individual trivia. Sure, sure. But I just made two categories for the sake of time. Okay. First category is Trustful History. All right. The other category is Trustful Football. And so we've got five questions in each. All Two, right. four, six, eight hundred, and a thousand. So, where do you want to go first? Let's, let's start with trust. We'll start at the top. Trustful history for two yeah, hundred. For two hundred. This large trustful-based manufacturer of fire extinguishers is located across from Payne Elementary School. Do you want me to answer it in the form of a question? That's how I typed it out. So okay. yeah, what I need it exactly. What What is Amerex? There you go. <laughs> we'll accept it, Amerex Corporation, but we'll accept Amerex. I'm just playing, maybe. <laughs> All right, you got that one right. You just want to go down the list? Yeah, let's just go down. All right. For 400. For 400. This man, ooh, this one might be tough. This man, whose last name graces a street sign near the Applebee's and Cracker Barrel, was the city's first mayor. Ooh. That's, uh, that, that's maybe more like an $800 question, but. Ooh. Ugh. He also had a department store on what is Main Street now. Uh, okay, well then I'm going to guess what is Braden. That's not right, but that's my guess. You gave, a, you gave it a whirl. Horace Norrell. Okay, I would. He, he was the first mayor. He was now mayor. That, now that you it, it say clicks. that, I can see that Norrell. Norrell Drive? Yeah. 1947 to 1960. I would not have ever uh, guessed hey, that. Hey, well, this is, we're, we're, <laughs> I'm going to go to your school. On the Cahaba Elementary School campus once stood a blast furnace. It supplied this product during World War I. Uh, uh, okay. I got a couple of things I'm thinking of. <laughs> uh, what is iron ore? Hey, well, iron. Okay. Iron. Yeah. Yeah. Bingo. We got it. <laughs> All right. For 800, because of its plain view of the area of the dismantled blast furnace, this was the first name of the Cahaba project or Cahaba homestead village. Uh, what is Slag Heap Village? That was an easy one. See, I should have flipped the 400 yeah, and 800. that would have been a good flip right there. There you go. <laughs> All right, for 1,000. Trustful is home to the oldest African-American church in Jefferson County, founded by slaves in 1857. What is the name of that church? Oh, gosh. Um, Me and your dad have talked it's, about it. it uh, uh, I'm going to be mad if I get this wrong. It's, uh, what is, is it Mount Pleasant? You got half of it. You got the Mount. Mount Joy? Maybe? Mount Joy Mount Baptist Joy? Church. Okay. We'll let you have one hint. I mean, I'm not Ken Jennings. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll play it easy with you. All right. That's, that, All that, right. Was, that was history. So let, let's go to maybe a little yeah, more go, of your wheelhouse. Let's go football. So we're going to go trustful football okay. for 200. Yeah. This former, I think I'm right on this. I think maybe you told me this in the okay. press. Uh, this former Hewitt trustful football player is the only player in program history to have his jersey number retired. Who's Jay Barker? And what was that number? Number 11. All right, there you go. We'll give you two. Still don't have 11 in our program. It's, and it's my favorite number. Not because of Jay Barker. I love Jay, but anyway. For 400, with six wins in 2023, Josh Floyd will tie this former Huskies head coach for second in program history with 79 victories. Well, it's got, who is Hal Riddle? It's got to be Coach Riddle. Bingo. It's got to be. Jack holds the record way ahead with 141. Yeah. All right, 600. Yeah, he was here for, what, 82 to 2001? 83 so, to 01. 83 to 01, yeah. yeah. And speaking of Coach Wood, Hewitt Trustful was Jack Wood's only head coaching position at the high school level, and he's the winningest coach in program history. This high school was his only other coaching stop of employment. Uh, what is Auburn High School? Oh, you did know it. We were talking before camera that that one might be. <laughs> well, I don't know that a lot of people know that. I, Maybe I'm no, wrong. No, um, I, I, I've been fortunate. I'm on the uh, Football Coach Association right. board with Coach Wood, so I, I've, I've been talking with him a lot. So, so you it's, know. It's, I, yes, I've, I've, I know that answer. I need to get Coach Wood up here. You do. All you right, did. 800. Hewitt Trustful Football has reached the state championship game one time in its history in 1992. The Huskies lost to this team. Who is Lee Montgomery? You know the score. I mean, you're right, but I'm just curious. Uh, was it uh, – I don't know the score. 14 zip. I, I knew 14 was in there. I couldn't think of what the <laughs> other one was. Um, Got to get back. <laughs> All right, for 1,000. You're telling me, by the way. <laughs> for 1,000. Now, this is the one I did tell you that I had to kind of 
do some looking, you know. Okay. I, will, I don't know that many people would know this off the top of their head. So might be a guess, but you're four out of four on football. So okay. Let's no, see if I can no, five no pressure. Five. I mean, Just run the category. All right. Hewitt Trustful has faced this team the most times in school history, splitting 56 games, 28 to 28, and tying four, of the, four more games. The schools have not faced each other, though, since 1993. I think I actually do know the answer to this question. I have a hint in it, but if you actually know it, I'm not going to give you a hint. I think I know it. I'd be very impressed. It's Leeds, isn't it? It is Leeds High School. I thought it was Leeds. Yes. Yeah, I, uh, I, my hint was going to be it might it might be time for a new wave of this series, <laughs> the green wave. Uh, but yeah. the, I think I did that out because just from, like you said, looking at the Historical Society side, it's it like – It stands out. It's like, man, that's, that's, I didn't it realize does. that. Because it, it'll, like, it'll have a little category that says longest-running rival, or like, and it's like Leeds. <laughs> yeah. I didn't that's, them. That was a part of the note when I looked at it. It's like <laughs> they haven't played them since 1993, <laughs> but it showed the first game they played was 1929 – Ten days before the stock market crash, That's kicking off the Great Depression. That is insane. Yeah, That's you crazy. did. Hey, you went went five out of five in football. So I'll, I'll you, take it. You get to keep I'll your coaching it. job. I'll take so That's it. good. <laughs> and uh, looks like four out of five. So nine out of ten. I'll take it. That's good. Ninety percent. That's good. That's about what no I was. Pressure. About what it was on Jeopardy. So I'll there take you it. go. There you go. I mean, I don't know if this was more or less pressure. Maybe a little less. <laughs> I don't know. 